Emily. Emily, what are you doing? You're not even looking at me. What did I do? And was I late? Morning, everyone. It's so funny. My, my cat is standing at attention just behind the camera. That's very cute. He, it's like he thinks I'm talking to him. And I am talking to you. Uh, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. It is Vlogmas Day 12. Um, <clears throat> Thursday. So I I opened my last Nora George, um, so my 12 skeins are here. They're 10 grams each, more or less, so it's about 120 grams, which is more than enough for a hat, one hat, not enough for two. Um, so I don't know, I'm like thinking through what I might do. I may, I'm not going to be here this weekend. If I were here this weekend, I'd probably cake these up and play around with them. Um, but uh, since I won't be here, maybe I'll play around with these uh, next weekend uh, or take them up during the week. It's pretty intense at work right now just because it's the end of the semester and um, we're all burned out, <laughs> faculty and students alike. Um, so we're, we're just slogging through. So I, I have a lot of grading to do. I have papers that they've handed in haven't finished and they're handing in more papers next week so I gotta get that done today and tomorrow the current ones so that I'm all caught up when they hand in the next group I don't know why I digressed on that oh just to let you know that I don't really think I'm gonna get more knitting done than usual next week but the week after that two next two weeks I'm on vacation uh, 
sorry, I just wanted to show you. This is what I'm thinking I might make with these. So this is a pattern with purchase. I bought from Toft these pom-poms. Um, so I got the pattern. It's for DK, but I think I think I could get away with it with this yarn because this yarn's pretty toothy and it has a loft, so um, maybe with a little minor adjustments. And I was thinking I might do some sort of gradient. Probably finish this just in time for Christmas. I'll be able to wear it one day and then that'll be it. It'll go away till next year. <laughs> um, I, I love the white brim, so I would do the white brim. And my first thought was that I would just do some sort of gradient like this. I could mix in the tan. Um, but I don't think that's enough. Like, I don't know if I can manage that without adding in some red. If I could, then that means I would be able to wear it other than Christmas. I feel like these two together, it's Christmas. So I don't know. I mean, I have gold and I do have brown. Maybe, maybe I can make that work. I don't know. Thoughts for another day. <laughs> Um, all right, so today I'm actually kind of on a, on the late side right now. It's a little late. It's a beautiful sunny day, by the way. Snow's pretty much melted. It's dusting here and there, but um, I have another holiday party today. Uh, this one is a different group of people, and yeah, it's in a bar, more of a bar restaurant. So I'll be able to film. I'll, I'll do do little clips. I won't do long amounts but um yeah that'll be interesting fun other than that I'm just doing regular work stuff I did get my yarn yesterday and I didn't um share it because I didn't do an evening chat I'll show you show you the situation the Vogue Knitting Live situation so that is the yarn it's Ching Fiber um here the label's kind of hard to see because it's gray white. Um, anyway, Ching Fiber, Melted Surrey, Melted Baby Surrey, so it's, um, if you're not familiar with the blend, it's uh, Surrey, Alpaca, Silk, and a little bit of Nylon. So it's going to be very drapey. My Asylum Fiber that I picked up the other day is a little bit brighter, um, but I think it'll still be fine. I, I did look in my stash to see what I had that was closer in tone and I found this one, but this is so speckled and I mean, it's beautiful, but for this, I really wanted something that wasn't gonna speckle much. So I think this might be the way to go, even though it's way bright. It looks the, the um, color difference is bigger on screen than in, in life. Um, but you know what? I have a long ways to go before I'm doing cuffs and bottom ribbing because it's a top-down knit so I will think about it I may cake and swatch um, both of these just to see what I like if I like the when when this has been made into fabric I'll make a little fabric swatch and put them together and see if I like those together all right that is the plan but I'm excited because you know it's Vogue Fit Knitting Live New York you go big or go home. <laughs> so I figure I'll go big. Big and bright, eye-catching, and uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm excited to make this pattern. I may wear it nowhere. I may wear this sweater nowhere else other than Vogue, but that's okay. I'm okay with that. I, I joke, but anyway. I gotta get going. I will talk to you soon. Okay, oh, it's the, almost the end of the night. I am back from the party, which I completely forgot to vlog. I got just got into talking to people and a bunch, bunch of people, a whole bunch of people that I don't see all that often. I work with them, but I don't, um, they work in other colleges in the university and also they work in other parts of the university, other organizations in the university. So it was a nice opportunity for us to see each other and um, catch up with each other. And I just ended up talking, 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 talking. <laughs> All right. Um, so I made some tea and I, uh, I watched a scary 
trailer for Krampus, the Krampus movie. I, I'm going, I, I've said I'm going out to my friend's house in the Hamptons, and he really likes scary movies, so I'm going to suggest that for us this weekend. I don't know if he's seen it. It looks like it's right up his alley, and it's got Adam Scott, who's adorable, and uh, Tony Collette, who's delightful. So, yeah. Freaked me out a little, though. Uh, anyway, okay. Gonna do a little knitting. I'm gonna work on the neckband and uh, plaque it for my Hinley. Hope to finish it before I go to bed because I'd like to soak it and block it um, while I'm gone. And, um, or let it dry from blocking while I'm gone. And yeah, that is my night. I will see you tomorrow.